Hello and welcome to Stunning Memories, the channel where we take a nostalgic look at some of the most iconic movies and TV shows of the past. Today we are going to revisit the classic 1985 film Weird Science and see how the cast members have changed over the years. Let's get started. First up, we have Anthony Michael Hall, who portrayed the nerdy but lovable Gary Wallace. At just 17 years old in 1985, he stole hearts with his endearing portrayal. Today, at 55, Anthony has transitioned seamlessly into more mature roles, showcasing his versatility as an actor. He's happily married and continues to grace both the big and small screens with his talent. And who could forget Elon Mitchell Smith, who played the timid Wyatt Donnelly? At 16 years old, Elon charmed audiences with his portrayal of the lovable underdog. Now 54, he has ventured beyond acting, pursuing academia with a PhD in medieval studies. While he keeps a low profile, he's rumored to be happily settled down with his family, embracing a quieter life away from the spotlight. Now let's talk about the unforgettable Bill Paxton, who portrayed the notorious Chet Donnelly. In 1985, at the age of 30, Bill brought Chet to life with his unique blend of humor and menace. Sadly, Bill passed away at the age of 62 in 2017, leaving behind a legacy of memorable performances that continue to resonate with audiences worldwide. Moving on, we have Suzanne Snyder, who portrayed the feisty Deb. At just 23 years old in 1985, Suzanne charmed audiences with her wit and charisma. Today, at 61, she's embraced a quieter life away from Hollywood's glare, focusing on her passions and enjoying time with loved ones. Her infectious spirit continues to inspire fans everywhere. Now, let's talk about Judy Aronson, who portrayed the glamorous Hilly. In 1985, at the age of 21, Judy dazzled audiences with her beauty and grace. Now, 59, she's transitioned seamlessly into various roles both in front of and behind the camera. With a thriving career and a loving family, Judy continues to shine brightly in everything she does. Next up, we have Robert Downey Jr., who portrayed the charming Ian. At the tender age of 20 in 1985, Robert showcased his undeniable talent, leaving a lasting impression on audiences. Now 58, he's become a household name known for his iconic portrayal of Iron Man in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. With a thriving career and a loving family, Robert continues to inspire millions worldwide. Next, we have Robert Roosler, who portrayed the rebellious Max. Also 20 in 1985, Robert brought Max to life with his infectious energy and charisma. Now 58, He's enjoyed a successful career both in front of and behind the camera, with notable roles in various films and TV shows. With a passion for storytelling, Robert continues to captivate audiences with his diverse range of talents. Now let's talk about Vernon Wells, who portrayed the formidable Lord General. At 40 years old in 1985, Vernon commanded the screen with his powerful presence and commanding performance. Now 78, he's enjoyed a prolific career spanning decades, with memorable roles in numerous films and TV shows. With his wealth of experience and timeless talent, Vernon remains a respected figure in the entertainment industry. Next we have Britt Leach, who portrayed the lovable Al Wallace. At 47 years old in 1985, Britt brought warmth and humor to the screen. Now, 85, he's enjoyed a long and fulfilling career in Hollywood with a multitude of roles in film and television. Despite his age, Britt continues to charm audiences with his undeniable talent and infectious energy. Next, we have Pamela Gordon, who portrayed the Karen Wyatt's mother. At 48 years old in 1985, Pamela's portrayal of a nurturing mother resonated with audiences. Tragically, she passed away at the age of 66 in 2003, leaving behind a legacy of memorable performances. Her presence is deeply missed, but her talent lives on through her work on screen. 
Now, let's discuss Michael Berryman, who portrayed the menacing mutant biker. At 37 years old in 1985, Michael's imposing presence left a lasting impact on audiences. Now 75, he continues to be a force in the entertainment industry, with his distinct appearance and commanding performances. With a career spanning decades, Michael remains a beloved figure in Hollywood. Next, we have Kim Mollen, who portrayed the talented girl playing piano. At 23 years old in 1985, Kim mesmerized audiences with her musical skills. Now 61, she has transitioned into a successful career outside of acting, making a name for herself in the world of music. With her passion for the arts, Kim continues to inspire others with her creativity and talent. Next, we have John Kapalos, who portrayed the mischievous Dino. At 29 years old in 1985, John brought laughter to audiences with his comedic timing. Now 68, he's enjoyed a diverse career both on stage and screen, showcasing his versatility as an actor. With a wealth of experience under his belt, John remains a beloved figure in the entertainment industry. Next, the stunning Kelly LeBrock, who portrayed the enigmatic Lisa. In 1985, she dazzled audiences with her beauty and charm at the age of 25. Fast forward to today, and Kelly, now 63, continues to captivate with her timeless elegance. Although private about her personal life, she's rumored to be happily married and enjoying her well-deserved retirement. And that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this trip down memory lane and learned something new about the cast of Weird Science. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more stunning memories. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.